Stay tuned to create wipeouts for real arcs and circles in AutoCAD. Hey, as you might know, it is not possible to create wipeouts for arcs and circles in AutoCAD. We will get the following message if we try to do it. The reason here is because we are using an arc inside this polyline. But if we try our tool, it works perfectly. Be aware, this is an advanced AutoCAD tutorial. If you are totally new to this video topic, I suggest you to check one of my partner's videos below on the video description and then come back. Be hey AutoCAD, the world is not just made of straight lines, so give us something for circles too. Well, never mind. I just create a wipeout for circles. So let's apply this awesome command or tool to this sign. As you can see, this is a real circle. Let's try the command. One click and we're done here. Now let's move it down and just send it to the front. So let's explain how do we achieve this awesome command. First I'll draw a circle to test it. As you can see this is a real circle. The first thing that we're going to use is the command boundary. We'll pick a point inside our circle. As you can see, boundary give you a polyline and then we'll use flatten. We'll use L for last, which means the polyline. And then as you can see, what is happening here is flatten makes the polyline in many pieces. Now we can try the wipeout. We'll use L for last and then just for erase or to erase the polyline. So our wipeout is right there but it's behind so we also need to use the command draw order and again send it this time to the front that would be all of the steps if we will do this manually but if you know the lazy architect already. You know that all of this can be done in a single click, so let's do it. Let's go to the CUI Enter and let's create a new command. Whoa, whoa, what was that? The lazy architect? Random command? Oh, it says subscribe. Now use the following macro. Really quick. BO for boundary. Flatten. 
yes wipe out p for polyline yes and draw order for reading codes and exclusive updates follow and like our pages on the video description now if we test our new command with this block which has a circle on it let's see what happens click click and done awesome You saw the power of wipeouts for circles. Now enjoy and share. I upload videos every Tuesday, so don't forget to like the video, subscribe, and turn the notification bell on. I'm the Lazy Architecto. See you in the next tutorial. For reading code and exclusive update, don't forget. Come on, AutoCAD, give us something for Silk Corp.